This is the first video in which I'm going to call the DCEU the world of DC. This is going to be a lot to get used to. So it's no secret that once Zack Snyder was fired from DC and Warner Brothers, he has been extremely vocal about his plans within his series. Or more specifically how his universe was going to be more inspired by Injustice, in the sense that many of the beloved characters would get killed off. However, there is a certain revelation that had a lot of people scratching their heads. And this is all in relation to the uniform from a dead Robin that has been seen in Batman v Superman, who appears to have been murdered by the Joker Harley Quinn. Now everyone initially assumed that this was in fact going to be Jason Todd who was the dead Robin, mainly because it was the exact same thing that happened in the comics and that Jason Todd was the Robin who died at the hands of the Joker. But according to Zack Snyder, this wasn't exactly the case. Because as it turns out, it does appear that Zack Snyder did have the intention of killing off Dick Grayson instead of Jason Todd, and that in this version, Dick Grayson would never become Nightwing. And to me, this raises a lot more questions than it does answers. Because clearly, DC and Warner Brothers did have plans for Dick Grayson Nightwing for the future of Worlds of DC. Because for starters, Zack Snyder's claims were completely contradicted by one of David Ayer's previous comments. Because according to David Ayer, who of course directed Suicide Squad, he did mention that the dead Robin was in fact Jason Todd and not Dick Grayson. And plus we've known for quite some time that both DC and Warner Brothers have been planning on a Nightwing film, as to which would be connected to the world of DC. So again, DC and Warner Brothers did have plans for Nightwing for the future, and chances are they probably still do. Unless of course there is some sort of embargo in that the film division cannot use Dick Grayson, since the character is already being used for the Titans live action series. But then again we have both the CW Flash as well as the Worlds of DC's version of the Flash, so we really have no idea how the embargo thing works. But since Zack Snyder went out there in confirming that the dead Robin was in fact Dick Grayson, does that mean Dick Grayson is completely dead within the Worlds of DC? Probably not. And that's mainly due to the fact that Zack Snyder has been fired and therefore DC and Warner Brothers can do pretty much whatever they want with the universe. And plus nowhere in any of the films did they flat out say that the dead Robin was in fact Dick Grayson, so this could easily be retconned. And at the end of the day it does appear that DC and Warner Brothers still most likely have plans in using Nightwing in the near future, and considering how he is a very popular character I highly doubt that they're going to axe him off that easily. And sure, one could argue that it's going to take a lot of time before we do see the Nightwing solo movie, but who's not to say that Dick Grayson could make a cameo in one of the future films. So what do you think is the definitive fate for Dick Grayson Nightwing? Do you believe that he is 100% dead thanks to Zack Snyder's comments, or do you believe that they're going to retcon this in that Dick Grayson is still alive? Comment below and share some thoughts. And as always, thank you guys for watching this video, please like and subscribe, take care and have a good one.